So, one of the things I said in that last video was that I was using, I had used all files up to this point, and that uh, I hadn't used any sandpaper yet. And I think I want to point out that one of the things I do, when I'm kind of getting to a point where I want to see if these things are really looking like I want them to, that's the point where, even though I'm just kind of roughed in and I don't have anything, everything exactly where I want it, if I come in with sandpaper, I'll get a better idea of what's happening. So at this point, I'll go in and use some 220 grit and just kind of start seeing where, what it looks like as I start to smoothen out. Because there's a lot of this blue fleck on here. I've got a lot of funky shapes going on. And I don't know exactly where it's going to fall once I start to sand. So I'm going to sand this for a bit. And then I'm going to come back and file again and carve again. But this is just going to give me an opportunity to see what it really is starting to look like. So I'm just going to hit it real quick with this 220 and get an idea of what's happening in my shape here. So like some of these wedges down here, I'll bend it down really tight to get into those angles. And then I'll sort of continue to sand just what looks like it's starting to shape, shape but I can't really tell yet. So I'm just gonna smooth out a whole bunch of this and start to see what happens as it starts to take shape. Dust this all off with some paper towel or something now. I can start to get a better view of how things are coming along. And I'm starting to feel like it's getting there. It's starting to look like a cat on a ring. Tail is starting to be a little more defined as it wraps around the whole ring. And this part in here is going to need some little scraping details to get the feet and everything done. But you can see if you come in with some sandpaper, it'll help you feel like, okay, maybe I am making progress. Maybe this is starting to make sense. Um, especially when you start to start not to know what to carve next. Coming in and sanding everything up and just smoothing out what you've done so far is a good way to get a sort of recalibration of, your, of what you're working on. And then you just got to keep at it. It'll get there eventually. There you go.